hello. If this is your first time clicking on one of my videos or visiting my channel, welcome. My name is Rochelle. I make videos about lifestyle, which include fashion and college and stuff along those lines. So if that's something you're interested in, subscribe to my channel. Anyways, today's video is inspired by Marla Catherine and all the many YouTubers who have done this video already. This video is an outfit of the week for university. So there's one slight issue. So because the coronavirus is a thing and now schools are either closed or if you're in university college, all the classes have been moved online. I don't physically go into school to wear these outfits, but I thought I would do it online school style. So this video is gonna be kind of different because I'm not actually gonna be wearing these outfits into school. Yeah, the coronavirus ain't gonna crush my plans on doing this video because I'm gonna do it anyways. So let's just get into this video, shall we? Good morning, guys. Today is the first day of online school. That means it is Monday. Mondays, I sometimes have a full day of class from 9.30 to 5.30. But then some days I just have a half day. But because it's a Monday and sometimes it's a very long school day, I like to be comfortable, but at the same time dress cute. My mirror's not very wide, so it might be kind of hard to see the entire outfit, but this is the fit for today. I am wearing this striped rugby shirt from Brandy. I'm wearing these blue skinny jeans from Garage. I like to wear skinny jeans with this top because this top is kind of loose. And because I'm sure if I wear like a baggy top with baggier jeans, then that kind of just makes me look shorter, which I don't really want. So that's why I go for skinny jeans to give my body a little bit more length. I also tuck the front of my shirt into my jeans like so. I do this again because I'm not the tallest person in the world. So I feel like if I don't tuck it in, I kind of just lose my waist in there and I don't want that. So that's why I tuck it in so it brings back my waist. Also, I feel like if I tuck in my shirt at the front, it makes the look a little bit cleaner, maybe a little bit more stylistic. For shoes, I am wearing these Adidas Superstars. Ugh, I can't really get my face and my foot in the mirror at the same time. Because it's also spring, I like to go for footwear that's a little bit brighter. So wearing white shoes always just kind of complements the outfit a little bit, especially because this top is so dark. I mean, these light blue jeans help, but these white shoes really do the job of putting the whole outfit together and making it look pleasing in a sense. Yeah, sure, let's go with that. But yeah, this is the entire outfit. I think it's pretty cute and obviously it's so comfortable so it's perfect for my long school days and a Monday in general because Monday is the day after the weekend and we all feel like crap after the weekend. Alright guys, so that is my outfit for today and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, it's Tuesday which is also day two of online school and it is so boring, not gonna lie. I don't know how I feel about that just because I have so much time at home and I just keep procrastinating. So I'm not actually doing my work. I kind of just procrastinate, yeah. So am I being productive? No, not really. Anyways, usually on Tuesdays, I have a full day of class as well. I have classes from 9.30 all the way to 3.30, so it's a pretty long day as well. But for some reason on Tuesdays, I like to dress a little bit more fancy for some unknown reason. I can't explain it. I still like to be comfortable for school, but it's kind of more dressy in a sense. But yeah, this is my outfit for today. I am basically wearing all black. I feel like this all black outfit is very slick and that's why I kind of get the very fancy vibes from it. Maybe it's also these trousers as well that makes it look fancy. My top is this cropped black tight short sleeves and it's also like a mock neck as well. So the mock neck is kind of perfect for this weather because it's not too hot outside and it's not too cold. So it's just like in between. So wearing this won't make me like super sweaty. This top is from Garage. And then I am wearing these trousers. I don't know what you call this pattern. Is it like grid-like? Grid-like pattern? Sure, let's go with grid-like pattern. These pants are from Banana Republic in the petite section. The only section that fits me there. The pattern is white, so it kind of gives the outfit a little bit more color on this black on black outfit. These trousers are a little big for me around the waist just because for my body type, I have bigger thighs and then like a smaller waist. So I find it really difficult to kind of shop when I'm looking for pants. So what I do is I sometimes go up a size just so that the pants fit 
my legs and then I'll just wear a belt to just cinch up the waist a little bit to make them fit me properly. <laughs> like so, this belt is keeping up my pants. This belt is like a brown shade of color. So yeah, this belt just helps separate the black top and the black bottoms. And then for shoes, I'm wearing these black booties with like a brown heel. They just make the outfit look very put together. So yeah, that is the reason why I chose to wear these booties with this outfit. I didn't realize this when I was talking to you guys, but this is like an online school outfits of the week edition. I don't actually wear shoes inside the house, but I am showing you shoes with these outfits just because, I don't know, I feel like being barefoot and showing you these outfits is just kind of weird. And plus, shoes complete the outfit. You can't just not go without shoes. I am also wearing jewelry with this outfit. I am wearing this infinity ring from Pandora. And of course, because I live in Canada, it's not super warm this time of year. Even though I'm self-isolating and I'm not going outside, I still need a jacket. This suede jacket is from Nordstrom's. So yeah, that's the finished look. I'm basically wearing all black and brown. I am wearing all black and brown. Here's one more full body view of the entire outfit. Okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Welcome to day three of online school and being quarantined at home. Self-isolation actually sucks. It's so boring. I actually woke up today and I thought it was Saturday, but it's only Wednesday. And then when I found out it was only Wednesday, that made me so sad because this week is so long. But I guess a lot of us are in the same boat, so I can't complain. You know what, let's just skip to the part where I just show you my outfit for today because that's why you're all here. So on Wednesdays, I'm only at school for a half a day. In the morning, I'm at home, and then in the afternoon is when I go to school, and that's when I have a four hour lecture. So in my four hour lecture, I kind of get restless, maybe even fall asleep in that class. Yeah, that's actually happened before. I fell asleep in that class a few times already. So there's that. Anyways, that means I need to be comfortable in class. So this is my outfit for today. I feel like I'm kind of far away from the mirror, but that is because I won't be able to show you the full outfit if I'm any closer. But good thing I'm short, right? Because if I was any taller, I would be further away from the mirror. For my top, I am wearing this form-fitting, tight-fitting, whatever you call it, striped long sleeve top. This is from Garage. So the sleeves are a little long on me because I have short little arms like the T-Rexes. Are they T-Rexes? Are T-Rexes the dinosaurs that have those little short little arms? But yeah, I chose this top because the rest of my outfit is kind of plain. So wearing this striped pattern just kind of makes the outfit pop a little bit more. My pants, I don't know my colors, but it could be a jay green or camo green. I don't know. Again, these pants are from Garage. Literally all my jeans are from Garage. I don't even know why, it kind of just happened. But yeah, I feel like these jeans kind of just complement the top. I've actually never worn these jeans with this top before. I just kind of like how it looks right now. I mean, when I wear these pants I kind of go for a more neutral top but today I decided to go for a bolder top because you know gotta live a little during the coronavirus where we're all stuck at home and quarantined inside the house like I said before my outfit's kind of simple just because I need to be comfortable to be able to take my nap in class for shoes I'm wearing my black vans I was gonna go for a colored scrunchie similar to one of the colors on my top but I decided to go for a color that still went with the outfit but not on my top just because it adds a little bit of spiciness and it kind of stands out a little bit yeah so this is my entire outfit okay so that is all for my outfit for today i will see you guys tomorrow or for you guys it'd be like two seconds hi guys welcome to day four of self-isolation i am actually so over this self-isolation thing because i don't like staying inside the house for this long i mean i went outside yesterday for a little bit and that was really refreshing. This corona thing just needs to settle down or even better, go away. This is my outfit for today. For my shirt, I got this green button up crop top and it, this is from Garage. For my pants, I'm also wearing these black skinny jeans from Garage. And then again, I cuff my jeans at the bottom because they are too long on me. Guys, I am 4'11", so I am very short for my age. So if you're watching this video right now and you're very short and you just need some help styling clothes, then you should watch the video I made showing you how I style clothing as a shorty, which will be up in the letter I. I am now realizing that majority of my closet is from Garage. I actually do shop there a lot. I think it's also the fact that Garage clothing fits me very well and that's why I always shop there. For my shoes, I am again wearing these black booties from Aldo. Again, also with this look, I wanted to create the very classic look and I find that pairing these boots with anything just gives it that more put-together classy stylish you know semi-formal look 
For my jacket, I am wearing this light brown teddy coat. It has this like Sherpa material inside and outside. So it's like super cozy and super warm, especially for this type of weather right now in Canada where it's not like super warm or super springy. It's kind of like cold, but not cold, if that makes any sense. So this keeps me warm outside, but like I'm inside right now, so I'm like sweating. This whole outfit is giving me serious winter vibes. I think it's just a color combination, but like I am feeling very wintry. But yeah, this is my last outfit of the week. The reason why this is my last outfit of the week is because I do not have school on Fridays. I actually have a three day weekend on Fridays when I just stay home. I kind of just stay in my PJs or get into cozy clothes. I'm gonna take off this teddy coat right now. It's so fuzzy that it's making me so sweaty and uncomfortable. So thank you guys for watching this video. If you stay till the end of this video and you are still currently watching, you are awesome. I hope you like seeing what I wear on a usual week of school. If you are having trouble with putting outfits together, Together. Hopefully I just gave you some ideas on what to wear and how to style clothing. Other than that, thank you again for watching my video. Be sure to give my video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. Oh, one more thing. Stay safe guys and don't get the coronavirus. If it's fine by you, I'll take the passenger seat. We can drive around to the sky and see me. If it's fine by you, I'll take the passenger seat.